What's up guys? This is 2015 Rock in the Field Rundown, a look at 2015 Rock in the Field Day 2. Wow. Day 2 of 2015 Rock in the Field was also their annual uh, jam, 110 jam sessions as they held this year. Also performing uh, Saturday, August. August the 1st was Walden Academy, Until Red, Johnny McQuaid Band, Pigeon Park, Wattenhoff Basin, Moist, and Tea Party. I have to say, looking at the lineup, Day 2 of 2015 Rocking the Fields, sorry, August the 1st, I gotta say, it was a stellar knockout lineup. Uh, looking at Moist, first, very first time I first heard, uh, first seen the band live in person at 15 Rock in the Fields. Especially with all the rain that came down, it was on off, on off, but hey, Moist, they still kept on their farm, they still kept doing what they're supposed to do. Uh, Why is those bases? After seeing them live at 2015 Rock in the Fields, I was very impressed. I was very impressed. I was like, wow. Um, the one band that. <coughs> The one band, well, there's actually two, but the one band I said to you guys before I put the team rock in the fields was even here. I said to you, what was the one band that people were talking about? The one band that I really in my, that, that's, I would have to say, is Pigeon Park. Now, speaking of Pigeon Park, I have also bought their latest album, Stripes. Bought it from this year's with the team Mark and Jules, our merch booth, and also to come this week. I'm going to be doing a review, a drone cover of Pigeon Park this week, guys. 2015 uh, Rock and Jules. This is a band that I first heard, but this band, they are, they are awesome. They, after seeing them live in 2015 Rock in the Fields, I was like, very impressed with a band like Pigeon Park. But, uh, also, Part of day two of 2015 Rock in the Fields was this band. D Party. After watching their performance in its entirely, I was just like, wow. I was just like blown away of T Party's performance. For and yes, stay tuned this week because if you guys don't know where you can see this, I got tons and tons and tons of videos uh, of performances from Pigeon Park, Glorious Sons, Daughtry, Moist. I guess the old saying goes, I got my work cut out for me. But uh, I'm speaking of uh, newer albums. I have also got my hands on a Tea Party album. Well, not just any Tea Party album. This is a, a, a Tea Party album. And I'll be talking more about this all this week, guys. A Tea Party album that's live from Australia. 
And I'm sorry to say my voice sounds uh, like a frog in the throat, but hey, that's that's the price you pay being at Clifton King Rock in the Fields.